so the new version of CapCut PC has new keyframe animation feature. Now let's go to the text and add this default text. I'm going to select this. I'm going to select all this text and I'm going to type this bar. Now let's increase the font size and let's change this to D dot. Let's zoom out and now let's scroll down. We can increase the scale to fill the screen right about here. Now I'm going to play this right here. So this is going to be the progress bar. Now I'm going to only change my X position. So go to the next frame and add a keyframe in position. Now I'm going to change my X position to minus 3000. Let's change this to 38, 39. Now I think we are good. Now go to the second last frame and I'm going to type 0. So now if we play this video as you can see guys now we have this progress bar. Now if you right click and right here we have new feature show keyframe animation. We can click here and we animate the exposition so we can select this we can click here to open the graph. Now we can select this keyframe. We can smooth out this animation. We can select this keyframe and we can also smooth out this keyframe animation. So now we will have this animation. So this is a new keyframe animation feature. Now we can hide this. We can right click hide keyframe animation. So we will have this keyframe. Before we can't move any keyframe. Now we can move this keyframe as well. Now I'm going to also improve this bar so we can click here we can change the color so I'm going to change this color to this one and scroll down we have to add a glow as well. So now I'm going to zoom in and I'm going to increase the range and I'm going to lower intensity. So we will have this smooth bar right here. Now we can also add a media so I'm going to play this media right here. And now as you can see guys this video is pretty long. So we can also increase the duration of this progress bar. So for example let's change this to maybe 10 second video. So I'm going to increase my progress bar and I'm going to select my keyframe and I'm going to play this keyframe right here. And now as you can see guys now we have the progress bar for this video. We can also if you want to change the duration we can also change this. Let's drag this keyframe right here and now we can trim this. And now have a look. We have the progress bar for this video. And the best thing about this progress bar is we can customize this later if we want to. We can change the glow color. We can also change the color of this progress bar as well.